Hey everybody, Keith K, and we are back here at Stranded Deep with an update on piles. Um, one of the new features released in 0.80. Uh, we'll also take a quick look at some of the inventory changes that came with that. And uh, apologies for not posting in a while. I have been super busy uh, between the summer and work, um, but I will get back on a schedule. So let's take a look uh, today at piles. Uh, piles are a easy way of organizing uh, collections of resources, so sticks, uh, leaves, fibrous leaves, uh, also um, coils of rope, rocks, clay, other things like that, wood logs. I uh, haven't tried everything. Um, I know you can't pile rawhide, uh, and I also tried coconuts that didn't work, uh, but they are uh, nice easy ways to, to put together a collection of resources in one spot, and you can see this pile here has uh, 50 leaves in it. Uh, that seems to be the limit for everything except for logs, uh, which I believe is 10. Um, and uh, you can see here's a pile with just three leaves in it. So the pile does grow as you add to it and um, you will be able to switch over to your backpack and add to or take from the pile just like you would uh, a crate. In fact, that's the yeah, still the image of the pile is the uh, the storage crate. So if you're familiar with that mechanism, you can see you can just grab, switch to your backpack, and also put them into the pile. And then 50 is the limit. Uh, you might have noticed there that uh, the backpack is showing up here now instead of down below. Uh, that's true with any of the storage crates. So a regular storage crates, the same thing. Backpacks up here and then the crates up here. All right, and the other thing that has changed is the inventory layout here. Uh, you can see that this was the backpack or the storage crate or the pile. Um, when you're not interacting with storage, then it is your empty hand, and the top slot is reserved for whatever you have currently equipped. So you can see in this case I've got four refined spears. If I equip one, um, it moves one spear up here to the currently equipped inventory, and then you've got the three remaining over here. Minor changes, but um, the developers seem to think that that will provide some quality of life improvements. Uh, the piles were uh, billed as a way to uh, improve performance. I guess instead of loading, you know, 50, whatever I've got here, 53 leaves, it's just loading two piles and then, you know, the attribute for how many. One other update that I'm sure folks really appreciate is the storage slots in these wood containers has been expanded to five. Previously, uh, each wood container only had three storage slots. These three were all full previously. Um, so you can see this one, I haven't updated, I haven't added anything to it. This had three full slots, but there are two more here. Uh, and you can see it's full in this one. So that, that expands your storage capabilities a fair amount, which is great. Uh, if you've seen my, uh, the way I had my storage set up previously, um, you know, I had just a pile of rocks and lashings like you see here on the ground. Um, I've put two rock piles here, uh, put these together uh, so you can see what those look like. Coconuts can't be piled. Um, and then the, the wood log piles look great too. Uh, they only hold 10, however. So let's take a look at how we craft a pile. So the first thing is um, you've got to have at least two of whatever it is you're creating a pile out of, right? So here we can't create anything, but if we have two or more, you get this little lashings pile. So I spent a little bit of time looking in the crafting menu um, and, you know, it's not there. Uh, you just either have two in your inventory or look at, you know, at two you have on the ground and you create your pile. So it'll show you what it's going to look like um, once it's full. And you simply place it where you want it. Now I've only had, I only had two in my inventory, right? So it's just a small pile and it might, you might think that you didn't create a pile, but as you add to it, it's going to sort of build out to that final look and we'll just do a few oh, here and it's the same setup as the storage box again so you're going to go into your backpack 
Now, if you start clicking here, you can. It's just going to keep putting whatever one in your currently equip equipped hand. So that's one way to not move around. Uh, now you can see we've got 17. So it's a bit of a pile there. All right, again, you just press tab to open it, just like the storage crate mechanism. And you can, you know, either add them from here or add them from your currently equipped item. You're just constantly re-equipping. -equip you see it's getting bigger now, it's at 38. All right, and you can see it's we're not getting a warning sound, but it's at 50. So all we can do now is um, create another pile. You seem to be able to stack them on top of each other. I don't really want to do that. Um, I don't know if you might run into trouble later trying to retrieve them. But that's it for piles in the new inventory management. Uh, hopefully you'll find this useful. If you found uh, the video helpful, please uh, give a like. And if you're interested in being notified when more of these drop, uh, please subscribe. As always, I appreciate you watching and look forward to seeing you back here soon.